I was thinking, you know, it's time for you to get your nails done. This is time it for you really to get them is. done. Yeah, they, they look, look pretty mess, bad. don't they? Yeah, I think you should get bubblegum square round nails. They look very nice. I think you. I should. How the f what? Square round. Yeah, Bubba gonna square around nails. Kim on, who you been around? Because that's very specific. Most dudes do not know about square round nails. So who have you been around? Because that's very specific. Like very, very specific. I know about my nails. What are you talking about? Okay, and where you get the color bubblegum from? Who taught you the color bubblegum? Who you been around? It's and you a lie if you say you ain't been around no girl, because yes, you have. Because how the hell you know square round nails? Around you. Don't you get square round nails? No, I don't get square I don't get square round nails. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, well, you might not like the square round. That's probably your attitude. How about uh, blue pink, blue pink coffin? The blue at the top. How the, the hell the do you know that about coffin so nails? You don't even go to the nail salon with me. And then when I show you my nails, you say, oh, they look the same as last week. So how in the hell? Why do short ass girls be so fucking mean, dude? Like you are five foot one. I will pick you up, put you on top of the fridge, and I'm not going to let you come down until you want to act nice to me. Okay, so today I am a human lie detector test and be advised as your mother, I will know when there is deception. Brian, you're first. What were you doing last night? I was on my game. Deception detected. Kyrie, what were you doing last night? Minding my business. Inconclusive. Try again. Watching Moesha on Netflix. No deception detected. Brian, let's give it another go. Mama, I was on my game. Deception detected. It's okay. Breathe. We'll try again in a moment. Savon, what were you doing last night? I was on the phone with a girl. Deception. I was with a girl last night. No deception detected. We will discuss that matter at a later date. Brian, I was on my game, mama. Deception. If you were on your game, which I confiscated last week, that means you went in my room to retrieve it. I wrecked your car, mama. You don't get tired of me fucking you up. You know what? I might even want to touch you. I'm taking everything out of your room. No phone, no TV, just white walls and silence. Do you understand? Do you fucking understand? Yes, ma'am. Fuck out of my kitchen. I really wanted to fuck y'all up. Next time, though. I don't even like my husband enough to be out here looking for his chin ass. I'm happy he gone. This the longest break I done ever had since we got married. He's controlling. I'm excited that he's missing. And then the police and y'all telling me I got to sit here and do a news interview asking for help. I don't want help. I like that he's missing. I don't want him to come home. But I don't want y'all, you know, when the cameras start and stuff, I cry a little bit and act like I miss him. But I don't. I don't want the police thinking I had something to do with it because I don't care, but I'm I'm tired of them. You get what I'm saying? Listen, I already done went to jail for holding my last boyfriend captive, but he deserved it. Exactly. So with my husband missing, they really going to think it's me. I ain't did nothing. So whenever you ready, I'm ready. ready? If anybody has seen my husband, please. I don't cry so much my tears won't even start falling out my eyes <laughs> baby if you listening to this if you hear this for anywhere please come home y'all please let my man free I love my husband I need my I heard somebody say it's live this live it's been live the whole time yeah, can we get two chicken sandwiches okay chicken sandwich uh that's your girl yeah. Wow. You are stunning. Oh, thank you. How long y'all been together? Oh, we've been together 10 years. 10 years? I don't see a ring on her finger. Oh, that's because we didn't get married yet. Wow. I went out with somebody that beautiful. I would definitely have a ring on her finger by now. Okay, that's good for you. How is that good for me? I mean, it's good for you if that's what you want to do. Who said that's what I want to do? You said that's what you would do. I didn't say that's what I want to do. I said that's what I would have did. Bro, can I just get my chicken sandwich? Can you get your chicken sandwich? Can you? Yo, what's your problem? I didn't know we had a problem. What you gonna do to solve it? Hey, baby, let me help you with- No, no, I'm good. You still mad at me? You shot at me! You hit me with the car and you almost killed me! Of course I'm mad at you! Baby, I didn't almost kill you because if I wanted you dead, you would be dead. I only shot at you and hit you with the car because I love you. My anger is proof of my love. I mean, you did put him in a house. Yo, shut the f up, my nigga! You can catch the bus! 
You forgive me? You don't answer me when I talk to you! Okay. Okay, I'm gonna take you to go get your nails done so you can look real pretty. I don't wanna get my nails done. I wanna get my nails done. So give me your wallet. You know the drill. You know what? I hate your girl, man. My check him! Fam, do you wanna die? Okay. We all gonna go get our nails done. We gonna look so pretty. These Chinese people make you look so pretty. You gonna look so pretty, baby. I want you to look your generation is lazy. Y'all don't want to work these days. Look at me. I worked 850 hours this week. I ain't spent no time with my family. My back is falling apart. I can't afford health insurance and I'm barely making ends meet. So what's y'all excuse? What the f you mean? What's my excuse? I don't need an excuse. I don't want to live like that. Yeah. Mm hmm. Cause y'all lazy. No, cause it's fucking stupid. What? That ain't no damn gotcha. What the hell? I don't want to. Why would I would do that stupid? Cause that's how things work. Things barely worked like that when you was a damn kid. So I know they ain't f***ing working like that now. Yeah, y'all all Y'all just want to sell candles and be tuber used and screamers and shit. Cause that's the type of shit that's, that they gotta do. Cause that's the only thing gonna help. We cannot work at Home Depot, Walgreens, Target, Best Buy, and none of these regular f***ing jobs and survive. Everybody gotta be aiming for the goddamn top or you're f***ing. Yeah, even after you climb to the top of a shit mountain, it's still gonna smell like shit. Well, yeah, you know what? Smelling the shit from the top sound like it's a whole hell of a lot f***ing better than standing on the ground, still smelling the shit, pretending like you at the f***ing top. Hey, Veronica, do you have a second? Yep. I just needed to bring it to your attention because I was told that you're a little difficult to work with and a little combative. Who told you that? I can't really tell you who told me to avoid. What do you mean you can't tell me? Well, to avoid any conflicts or, you know, hostile work environment. Okay. And what was the situation that made me difficult to work with? I feel like if I tell you that, it narrowed down the person that it was with. So, so you're can't... coming to me telling me that someone thinks I'm difficult to work with. You won't tell me who it is and you won't tell me what the situation was. I just wanted to bring it to you. If this was a court of law, I have the right to face my accuser. How do you know that this person doesn't have a personal vendetta against me? I, I didn't. How do you I know didn't. that this person's intentions are legit and not just trying to get me fired or try to get me in trouble when I can't defend myself adequately because you won't tell me who it is? I just wanted to bring it up so you could work on your behavior. Well, I can't fix a problem that I don't know is happening. If you won't tell me what the situation was or who the person was, then we don't even need to be having this conversation. I'm just trying to keep the peace. Uh, you know, I don't want you to be difficult. I just... I'm not trying to be difficult. I'm not trying to be difficult. But if you're going to come accusing me of something, then I want to be able to look that person in the face and make sure that they're being honest about what they're saying. But you want to protect them, that's fine. We don't need to have this conversation. And if we need to have it, then we're going to go to HR and then all of us are going to be there, including this mystery person. Do you think you could babysit your cousin? Of course I can. Yeah, if he cries, what do you do? If he cries? Yeah. I'm smacking the shit out of him. I'll be like, shut the fuck No, he's up. probably hungry. Oh, then, then I'll feed him. Okay, but what if he doesn't want food? Now I'm smacking him. I'll be like, bitch, eat these dinosaurs. No, he could be tired. Oh, then I'll lay him down for a nap. Okay, but what if he keeps crying? You already know, I'm fucking him up. No, you'll rock him. That's what I mean, I'm rocking his jaw like a bitch. No, I mean, rock him. Oh, rock him. Yes, and then he'll probably go to sleep. Okay, and then if he don't, that's when I'll be 